I'ma treat you like I got nothing left to live for. I'ma play some. Hey, what's up, guys? This is Yar Power back again. And today's video is how do you control your weight? Okay, I hate myself. I'm, I mean, you know, I'm not losing weight. I'm not gaining weight. Something's wrong with my body. Okay, I think so. My body is different than other people. I'm not losing weight. Why is it like that? Okay, it's not something like that. I'm gonna tell you simple ways. Okay, the banana saying hi. <laughs> okay, I'll tell you a really simple way, just to control your weight. If you know that. We have maintenance calories to maintain our current weight. Okay, so our body requires certain amount of calories to maintain our weight. Okay, once you know that maintenance calories. Okay, so if you eat above that maintenance calories, you'll obviously gain weight, and if you eat below that maintenance calories, you would lose weight. Okay, if you could see the diagram, I tried to make it on paint. You would realize it. The amount of calories you eat. Okay. If you eat above your maintenance calories, you'll gain weight. If you eat below it, you'll lose weight. Okay, so that's the first step. You need to know your maintenance calorie. Okay, so how how the heck do I calculate my maintenance calories? I can't just ask my body where is my maintenance calories. Okay, so there are three simple methods to calculate it. The link is in the description. So go to my description. Click. I've made a detailed video, and it's really easy. You just have to multiply your weight with a certain number, or there's an online calculator. Where you can just calculate it. Okay, so once you know that, you need to start tracking how much you eat. Okay, now the this is the first part. The second part is you need to track down. So let's say for your for example, you have your maintenance calorie is two thousand five hundred calories. Okay, so now you need to set up how do you eat it. Okay, so now once you know that your maintenance calories, uh. Just then, there are requirements. You know, you need to have certain amounts of protein, carbs, fats. Okay, even I've made a video about that. Okay, and it's kind of really easy. If you know your maintenance calories, then start eating as per that. Okay, so if your maintenance calories two thousand five hundred, if you want to gain weight, you'll eat above that. If you want to lose weight, you'll eat a little below that. Okay, and it's a consistent process. Okay, it's just not like you know one day if you eat low calories, you. Lose like one kg or one whatever two pounds of weight in one day. No, it's a really gradual process because you have gained all this fat for all these years. Okay, if you know that one pound of fat is three thousand five hundred calories, so you convert that to one kg of fat is seven thousand or seven thousand calories. Okay, so that's a long time, and uh, make sure you don't. A really big mistake I've seen is we all going really low calories. Okay, I've done that mistake as well. Okay, your bo body requires certain amount of certain amount of calories just to function normally, like your heart, your lungs. So that's called basic metabolic rate. Okay, so you can't go below that. Okay, then your body goes in starvation mode. Your body feels you know like hunger. There are a lot of hormones called leptin, ghrelin, or Which makes you feel really hungry, and, and then you eat a lot, and then again the yo-yo thing. Okay, so you just have to make little changes. So if you know your maintenance calories, eat below your maintenance, just like two three hundred calories below your maintenance level. Or if you want to gain weight, eat two three hundred calories above your maintenance level, and it's a gradual process, and you need to track down. Okay. And it takes a lot of time, okay, guys. You all just can't diet for one week and say, "Oh my God, I need to lose one two kgs." Like I'll lose one two kgs. You know, it's a really slow and a gradual process. It kind of takes around two, three, four months. It it makes sense if you think about it. If you if you're eating below your maintenance calories, just 200 calories less than your maintenance calories. If you calculate calculate like you know, 3,500 calories is equal to one pound of fat. So you know, it's gonna take a long time, and our body. Keeps on fluctuating. Okay, our water balance keeps on fluctuating. So the best measurement would not be your weighing scale. Okay, the best measurement would be you know taking a measurement tape and measuring your body parts or caliber or DEXA scan or body pod, you know body fat percentage scan. Okay, so that way. But for me right now, uh, I use a measurement tape on my waist, on my biceps, on my legs. So I realize you know and I track it weekly. Okay. So and take an average of it rather than you know just 
checking my weight today it's something else and tomorrow it's something else because your body keeps on fluctuating our water weight okay and it depends if you have a lot of carbs one day with one one you know one gram of carbs our body stores two grams of water with that so you know feed a lot of carbs and again water and maybe you have a, if you are in trust me uh if i've seen a lot of women who are on their periods they gain up to 5 10 pounds of weight and the next day they lose everything and even for the guys even for me stress 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 if i take a lot of stress i gain a lot of weight and the next day you know i get up and i sleep for a really long time i lose all my you know what of weight so make sure you keep a consistent track this is the basics and one more thing i really wanted to tell you all uh, just follow what works for you there are a lot of diets in the market okay uh, intermittent fasting keto diet Okay, keto diet is something where you just have fats and um, you know, and protein, no carbs. Or uh, uh, Atkins diet, Mediterranean diet, uh, Beach Body diet, and there are tons of diet. But if I give you, it's not about the best diet plan. It's about what works for you. Okay, if you can survive, I mean, if you can eat below your maintenance calories, calories, anyhow you want to, okay, and still feel satisfied, that's the best diet for you. Okay. something for me would be different than something for you people don't realize that people start you know okay this guy lost weight just by eating a uh, that diet i'm going to do that thing no what works for you what works for your you know everyone has different uh, schedules timings their jobs are different you know and the eating habits are different okay so what works for you okay i'm just and i'm giving you an overall thing where uh, you know this is how you control your weight so you, so again a summary summary of it i don't want to make this video really long um know your maintenance calories if you eat below that uh, you lose weight if you eat above that you gain weight it's a sim- it's a really simple logic and then you need to be consistent to it okay and slowly build a habit okay it's so not about you know one week you eat in uh, like below your ma- if you want to lose weight one week you eat below your maintenance calorie okay and you try to eat it you need to track down everything okay If you cannot uh, measure it, you cannot manage it. It's with everything. And it's a small thing when you start measuring. You know, you're having this much amount of food. That's gonna be, you know, the first week it's gonna be really difficult. But second week you start, you know, getting it. And you know, eat the same food again and again. That's one tip I could give you. There are hundreds of tips, and the you know, if you search on Google how to lose weight, there would be hundreds of tips. But this is a really simple video where I'm just gonna tell you, you know, what works, and it's a simple logic behind it. we get an idea okay yeah this is how it works so and uh, if you if you need to go more in detail go to my website uh, yaurpower.com/guides where i've made a video series or step by step instructions where you could just read you know how many amount you need to have or you need to get more information but this is a basic video on you know how do you control your weight okay so stay tuned for more yaurpower signing off